Is the latest from Deep Creek Strings as Clyde paces in the background. It's a tack head banjo with uh, calf skin tacked on top. It's a dyed tack uh, calf skin, uh, dyed it brown. It's got a tint to it that's a little bit darker than most of the tack heads I've built. The other New and interesting thing about this banjo is the rim. It is, uh, what the client asked for was a patchwork quilt rim. So it includes eight different woods. Let's see if I can name them. There's mahogany, maple, walnut, bloodwood, purple heart, um, Bubinga, good old oak, and one more, cherry. Eight different woods in the rim. It's capped with bloodwood. It has a bloodwood fretboard and a rosewood peghead. The peghead's mechanical tuners, their mechanical fiddle pegs, are installed. There at the fifth peg as well. Very distinctive piece of um, walnut for the neck. Almost what you would call a stripe right down the middle. Same piece of wood. Very pretty. Has an internal tensioning system. This banjo sounds great, looks really distinctive with this rim. I'm hoping that the client is going to be happy with this. It's pretty much exactly what he asked for. And uh, this banjo, for some reason, is louder than, than uh, the banjos I've created in the past. I wish I knew why. One of these days I'll be able to crack that nut, but uh, with tack head banjos, it's, it's I don't want to say it's hit or miss, but it's it's a little bit uh, more difficult to to uh, diagnose <laughs> stuff like that. Anyways, it's a great sounding banjo, and uh, that's the latest from Deep Creek Strings. <laughs>